What's up guys, Christian here back at you for Sneaker Talk with a brand new video and I just finished shopping at Bodega. If you haven't seen the last vlog, make sure you check it out. I'll leave a link down below. It's a convenience store that is the cover for a low-key sneaker shop and clothing store. It's so cool, so definitely check out that vlog. But right now we're in Boston. We're in Boston and I'm hungry, so let's grab some food. I don't really think that you can see But I know everything you do to me With you, girl, anything is possible So the vlog you're watching right now is actually the second half of my second day in Boston. So if you haven't checked out the first day or the other parts, make sure you check it out. But I'm super hungry, so we're looking for a place to grab some lunch. And then we're gonna go to a consignment store in Boston. I don't know if there's too many consignment stores here, but I know it's a really good consignment store. It's nearby, and we're gonna look at some very, very expensive sneakers. But yo, it is mad hot right now. It is like 35 degrees Celsius, which is like, what, 95 degrees Fahrenheit. Man, I need food, I need water. I'm looking for anything, just give me something. We, we can be unstoppable. One, one thing about your man. See, we not the same. We just don't work on it because it's not a game. I'm, I'm out for air. I am so hungry. Oh my gosh, I could eat a freaking buffet right now. So we're eating at this exotic Indian and Indo-Chinese restaurant. Let's see what's up. Oh man, this looks good. This looks so very good. So all done lunch, and man, that was really, really spicy food. That was so spicy, and it was a lot of food too. I felt bad because I couldn't bring it home because uh, I'm flying back home to Toronto. I don't think I can bring home food. But yeah, we're just gonna edit here at the, uh, the restaurant for a little bit, get some work done, and then we're gonna head to the consignment store because I have so much work to do, and my flight back home is at like 8.30 p.m. tonight, so I have a lot of time to kill, and I know there isn't too, too much to do in this general area besides Bodega and this consignment store we're about to go to, so yeah, I'm just gonna finish editing uh, yesterday's vlog. I haven't even started it yet, but it'll be fun, and then we're gonna get going to the consignment store. In them weeks, I think of you and all these people. I figure we're lost individuals. Yeah. What happened to you being you? Now you are flexing and hiding the truth. You only VIP up in the club, but won't be important when all of it's through. Just try to catch up and make. You see all your wrongs and I start in this change. I know that my money got up, but it's you who turned out not the same. I gotta tell Zian from Pickering, I miss her more than anything. I wish I knew what I do now for better first impressions. It's okay, cause things will switch on up and take some time. I just killed the glass of whiskey. So that was Laced Boston, the uh, consignment store here. And it was pretty neat, it was pretty small. They had a lot of Supreme, a lot of Bape. And uh, they actually recommended I check out another sneaker store in Boston called Sneaker, Sne what's it called again? It's called Sneaker Junkies. And it has a five star rating on Google. So it's gotta be good. From the images, it looks pretty dope. So hopefully I can film in there. Uh, but yeah, it's gonna be about a 20 minute walk. So we're here at Dunkin' Donuts. Once again, second time in my life at Dunkin' Donuts. Twice in one day, we got a like mango smoothie, so I can enjoy this walk. We're gonna rest a little here.
Yo, no way, there's a California pizza kitchen. I only know this restaurant because Timothy De La Ghetto got fired for calling it California Skeetza Kitchen or something like that on Twitter. And I think he got fired for doing that. So it turns out I am a total dumbass and I have been walking in the wrong direction for the last 15 minutes. How did I not notice sooner? Anyways, next time you see me, we'll be at the store. Okay, so I lied. We're not here yet. We took a detour. There's actually a Nike Boston here, a Nike store, so let's check out the store. Alright, so we're at the basketball and Jordan section of the Nike store. Some Jordan performance ones. Here's a look at the retro and lifestyles. Barons are everywhere. So are these. And then got some fours, low 13s. These are pretty dope for a Jordan one. Okay, okay. Here's a look at some of the running shoes and lifestyle models for Nike. And yeah, that's sick. That's actually sick. <laughs> but yeah, let's see what they got here. Air Max 90s on Air Maxes. Cortez season, some foams. Bro, these are so wild. Dang, these are like super duper vibrant. Oh my God. Here's a look at the Nike SB wall. Nothing too, too crazy. I've been seeing these Galaxy ones like everywhere. They're pretty dope. And then Roshi's. And then last but not least, Air Force Ones. You guys know I love my Air Force Ones. And then which ones are my favorite out of all the ones they have here? These are actually mad dope. <laughs> Yo, that's awesome. Man. What's your name? Danny. Danny? Yeah. Christian, nice to meet you. All right, so that's going to wrap up Nike store in Boston. Next up, ooh, ooh, Lambo. Oh. Lambo, hello. Next up, we have to go to Sneaker Junkies. Quick detour, we're in a CVS right now because I'm mad thirsty and I'm dying. It's like one million degrees outside. But this, only in America. Only in America would you find a bag of Sour Patch Kids and Swedish Fish this big. This is crazy, man. This is wild out here. I should buy one and just have it on display in my room. It's two pounds, two pounds. Great for sharing with yourself because I wouldn't share this with anybody. What to drink, what to drink. Should I ball out and get Fiji water? No, I'm just playing. Apparently these naked. I thought it was healthy when I got it the first time. But I did some research and these naked smoothie drinks are like really, really bad for you. My girlfriend buys this water, Voss water, just because the container they use for it is glass. So <laughs> she's just fancy like that, but it's actually carbonated water that isn't really the greatest. Powerade. All right, here we are, finally, Sneaker Junkies. All of my fans amaze me. And I've been feeling more than free, man. And I ain't even driving Daisy. Oh, you like that? No, I do. I've been doing everything I'm supposed to do. Made a buzz off rap when we spoke the truth and I ain't making no dope. Plan. Now I'm like, Marty Grimes only do it for the fam, only do it for the fam. This is that, that regiolidocious, make another girl, girls wet like oceans. We the focus, you should know this, got the whole room like, oh my god, who wrote this? Uh, yeah, what you know about me? What you know about me? My game's strong, we ain't going down like Rousey, we ain't going down like Rousey. Listen up, we the next up, all about a dream, not a pay stub, all about work, not a nightclub. All about time with the right ones, took a shot and I ain't even got guns. Had to switch things up, still spitting the facts Say fuck Green Bay, I'm ahead of the pack And we just trying to have fun like a Mike Stud Rap, yeah, cause we young and reckless Sleep until noon, never eating breakfast I just wanna find a way to make these summers endless Make these summers endless Alright, so that's gonna wrap up our time Here at Sneaker Junkie I gotta say, the staff there, some of the friendliest People in Boston, but with that said We're gonna go back to Bodega and pick up A piece I really wanted to get And then I gotta get going back to the hotel so I can catch My taxi ride back to the airport And while I was inside Sneaker Junkie There was a massive downpour Of rain, it's like ugh, I'm very happy I was inside the store The entire time Yeah, all the best. I hope all it goes best. well for you. And let your son know it's called Sneaker Talk. Sneaker Talk. Sneaker Talk. Super easy. Sneaker Talk. Take care. Have all a good right. flight. Cheers. We're at the airport now, and my taxi driver was honestly the coolest taxi driver I've ever had. I didn't catch his name, but he was the coolest guy ever. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, 
We're gonna get our flight tickets now and uh, start editing some videos in the waiting area. Why does airport food have to be so expensive? <laughs> well, I'm at the airport right now and uh, it is like 11 p.m. Turns out my flight got canceled and uh, that really sucks and I was expecting uh, to have to like sleep in the airport overnight but Converse hooked it up and uh, they're sending me to the Sheraton Hotel to stay a night there so thank you Converse for blessing me with the Uber and the hotel again. Ah, you guys are lifesavers, thank you so much. So we're ending the vlog today on a good positive note and uh, yeah, shout out to Converse and, and thank you guys so much for everything because like I would not be able to have these cool opportunities without all of your support. Sitting in my room thinking one day, uh, yeah, I still can't believe I got way more fans out in Germany than I do in my hometown. I don't know about you, but that's crazy to me. Been putting in work, so it works out. I've been spreading everywhere, I've got some word of mouth. But better tell the boys what I'm talking about. This is feeling like the big leagues, Mike Trout. D -d 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 I love you, Converse. I love you. I love you. <sighs> we are in the hotel. Hope. And, uh, pre fam. <sighs> Thank you, Converse. Thank you for. All your hospitality, you guys are the plug. Time to edit vlogs nonstop because I'm feeling insanely motivated, insanely hustle mode on. That did not make any grammatical. That did not make any grammatical. Grammatical. I'm mad hungry right now after all that walking I did today. And, and Converse said I could get room service and it's, it's on them. So, yeah. Let's, let's turn up. <laughs> let's turn up. Oh, never coming home. Put it in a song. Number one. Put it down. I'm just doing what I want. Yeah. I'm just doing what I want. Girls call me dad weird because I ain't got a son. Ha. Yeah. It's a celebration. Now we up. Similar to elevation. And all my tracks hot like we on vacation. Always keep it free like we on PlayStation. But for real, all of you, follow your dreams. Fuck a team if you know what I mean. I mean, do it on your own. Do your own thing. Because at the end of the day, 